Hello everyone. In this video here I'll be doing a demonstration on how to remove the salt stains on your vehicle's carpet. Now this is something that's pretty common to happen uh, over the winter time here. So I'll show you how to clean this all up so your vehicle does look nice and clean. Now the supplies needed in order to clean the uh, salt stains from your carpet here. Now what I have here, just a pail of warm uh, water, no soap or nothing mixed into it. I have a couple toothbrushes here, just a lighter coarse toothbrush just in case I do need to be a little more aggressive on the fibers itself. Then just a simple cloth here. And I also have a spray bottle here which is filled with a uh, mix of water and white vinegar. Now the white vinegar is 50% and the water is also 50%. So it's an equal mix together. Now you can mix it a little stronger. I've done it in the past before and found it does work quite well. Also just a little bit stronger. Uh, but the smell does tend to be a little more uh, potent than compared to when it just mixed a equal mix. Now before I start spraying down the uh, vinegar and water mix, uh, what I've done here first, I've already pre-done this, is actually taking a uh, shop vac and just cleaned any of the loose debris within the carpet itself. When you're rubbing this down, you want to make sure that all the any debris is loose so you don't rub it further into the carpet or it makes it a little hard to do the cleanup itself. Next, what I do here, just simply spray the vinegar and water solution on the area and just let it soak. Now what will happen here, the vinegar will actually break down the crystallized salt on the carpet fibers. Now after I've let it soak in there for a couple of minutes, I'll just take my damp cloth, making sure it's not too wet. We already sprayed water on the carpet itself, so we want to make sure there's not too much moisture in here, because that could cause any problems uh, just down the road. So what we'll do is just start giving it a light rub down here. And you can see a lot of the salt stain itself is actually broken up and disappeared. Now what we'll do next here, just taking a wet dry shop vac, we'll just vacuum any of the moisture out of the carpet itself. Now with regards to what type of vacuum cleaner you can use, I've had a, a few comments on my upholstery uh, shampooing video whether you can use just a normal vacuum cleaner as opposed to a wet dry one. Now wet dry ones are specifically designed to suck up any water or moisture, uh, therefore none of the moisture can actually destroy the internals as opposed to a standard style vacuum cleaner so I do highly recommend that you use a, a wet dry specific vacuum cleaner itself. Now after I've done vacuuming the carpet itself you can see what I'm left with something that looks like this. Now if you do have any salt crystals that are still within the carpet itself you can go through another time just to ensure that this is all clean and um, it is to your satisfaction. Now if you want to continue cleaning this uh, what I'll do is I'll post a uh, upholstery shampooing video that I done previously which I mentioned just a few minutes ago. I'll post that in the description so you can actually link to that and you can continue on. Uh, if you're just worried about the vinegar smell I find it does disappear but if you just want to go over it and clean any other dirt or stains out of your carpet itself you can refer to that video there. So this concludes my tutorial video on how to remove salt stains from the carpet. If you have any comments or questions please don't hesitate to post them below. Also please subscribe to my channel and rate this video. Thank you.